Got our rotary encoder here hooked up to an Arduino, um, which is right now just giving it power. Um, so we're going to take a look at it on the scope. Um, when it's turning this way, which we'll say is um, clockwise, we'll see the bottom signal go low first and the top signal will go low after that. So for each click of the rotary encoder, it there's a pulse and you can tell the direction because the bottom one when it's going clockwise goes goes low first. And now if I go back the other way, if I go counterclockwise, you'll see top one should be going low first. You can see there. If I go a little bit slower. So the rotary encoder is purely mechanical, so depending on how quickly I turn it between the notches, that's how long the, the each line goes low for.